Uh, good morning, Mr. Bradley. Good morning, Dr. House. Uh, did you figure out what's wrong with me? We got back the results from your first wave of tests, and I think we have some leads. Now, when you came in here, you were complaining about severe migraine headaches, accompanied by depression and an overwhelming feeling of impending doom. That's right. Well, I was studying your MRI, and I found a foreign object located just behind your ocular cavities. Oh my god, is it a tumor or something? Worse. There's no easy way to tell you this, so I'll just say it. Mr. Bradley, you have a brain lodged in your skull. A brain? Yes, a brain. And this brain is allowing you to be conscious and aware of the world around you, and we believe that this is the root cause of your depression and headaches. Level with me, Doc. Is there a cure? In my opinion, we have three options. First, if your insurance covers it, we go into surgery and disconnect the brain. Another option is to just make you watch Fox News Network for about a week, and your brain will voluntarily shut down. But the good news is, I think you'll find American culture kind of caters to the brainless. Uh, you can watch reality TV and sports, even listen to commercial radio without feeling uh, your intelligence being insulted. You can uh, shop at Walmart, attend church, support the war on terror, and vote for the media-approved corporate candidate, all without the creepy realization that you are working against your own best interests. Ignorance truly is bliss. You had mentioned a third option. What's that? Well, the third option is that you keep your brain and you learn to deal with the reality of the world, no matter how scary or frustrating or outrageous. But if you do, you will learn some essential truths about the world and humanity. Is there some special advantage to that? Nope. If you try to tell people about the truth, they'll usually just call you names and try to shut you up. Although it would make a great premise for a sketch comedy podcast. Well, fuck it, let's do that then. Done and done.